is a homogeneous mixture and can be separated into its components by fractional distillation in a cryogenic air separation unit. This process was pioneered by Dr. Carl von Linde in the early 20th century and is still used today to produce high purity gases. The components of air are separated by the following steps. Air is first filtered to remove dust and then compressed to a pressure between 520 kilopascal to 1100 kilopascal. During the compression process, the temperature of the gas rises. Therefore, the gas is cooled in stages until it reaches minus 200 degrees Celsius. At this temperature, it liquefies. Water vapor condenses and is removed during absorbent filters. Carbon dioxide freezes or dry ice at minus 79 degrees Celsius and is removed. Nitrogen liquefies at minus 196 degrees Celsius. The liquid nitrogen and oxygen are then separated by fractional distillation. In addition to oxygen, nitrogen, argon and rarely some other gas products like neon, Krypton and xenon also may be obtained. The liquefied air is passed into the bottom of a fractionating column, which is warmer at the bottom than it is at the top. The liquid nitrogen boils at the bottom of the column. Gaseous nitrogen rises to the top, where it is piped off and stored. Liquid oxygen collects at the bottom of the column. The boiling point of argon is close to the boiling point of oxygen. So a second fractionating column is often used to separate the argon from the oxygen.